more on the restoration. Good morning. Several artists helping out with that facelift. Okay, let's go ahead and just introduce you to these fabulous people here. We've got Sean and Francesca up on this side working on the mural, and then over on this side, Colleen and Sophie. I'm going to swing on over here to Mr. Dennis. Come on up here, Dennis, for just a quick second. Um, tell me a little bit about the history of this piece. By the way, this the new home of Solomon, uh, Solomon's Delicatessen opening later this fall. Oh, yeah. Uh, Tower Records wanted to open some smaller stores, and with a man named Rick Hernandez, they opened this one as the sound peddler because they wanted to do something completely different. Eventually, they renamed it Tower Records so that it would get more notoriety. But uh, Frank Carson saw this, this uh, opening here, and Russ Solomon and he discussed the idea of doing something with it, and this is what came about. We're making a documentary on it, so there'll be a little more detail to come, but basically they wanted something that was eye-popping here on the uh, K Street Mall back in 1973. Yeah, eye-popping then and certainly eye-popping now. Beautiful work, and we have to give a shout-out to Ms. Sofu Sophia, or Sophie Aronson, actually. Sophie Aronson's dad was working with Frank Carson on this. In the heat of the summer, in the heat of the Sacramento summer, for about three months on scaffolding here to get this to, to to be what it is and what it has been. And of course, it's faded over the years, but now, thanks to Ali Yusefi and Bay Mary and some of the other developers on this block, it's all coming back instead of being destroyed. Well, and this um, this beautiful painting here, the, this mural, is somewhat of a memorial to these three men who have passed away. Well, certainly, certainly, and and Mitch Aronson, who is also no longer with us. It's. Uh, it's a beautiful piece of work, and it's going to be even more beautiful in a couple of weeks when they're done. Okay, I'm going to swing on over here to Mr. Seamus. And Seamus, I know that you um, have been working for, you said, collectively with all the artists and all the hours, three weeks nonstop um, yes. to make this thing come back to life. What work is left to be done? Uh, well, if you look, put the camera straight up, we have this entire ceiling to do. And then oh. we have the facial, oops, sorry, facial area here on both left and right. And then uh, the face here has, still has to be done up there and then once we're done with that then it's a final inspection we coat it and then hopefully it'll last longer than the building uh, you know what that's how, I, 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 that, that's how much that's how much pain it has on this thing is going to be lasting for a long time i'm sure there's going to be a big grand opening celebration when uh, solomon's delicatessen opens later this fall you'll have an opportunity to come out and see this piece for yourself but certainly do uh, take a walk on the k sometime as the artists are going to be here for the next several weeks continuing the work mm -hmm. yes we'll probably be here for no later than another month, but two to three weeks for sure. Yeah, this is fantastic. You definitely want to come and see it for yourself. All right, back to you guys. Great, Absolutely. Bethany. Absolutely. I want to see all the artwork there. All right.